sometimes in maths or science we get really really big numbers or really really small numbers um, so here we've got the average distance to the Sun as 149.6 billion meters so instead of writing out that whole number what we can do is we can write it in what's called standard form so that is a number between 1 and 10 times 10 to a power so first thing we're going to look for is our number between 1 and 10 so it's kind of like where do I put the decimal point so it's going to be 1.496 so 1.496 times 10 to a power so how many times have I got to multiply 1.496 by 10 to get to this number so it will be once twice three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven times so this number is 1.496 times 10 to the power of 11 and also we get really really small numbers so the radius for an electron is 0 0.00000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000
9, 10 times. This number here will be 2.5 between 1 and 10. Again, it's going to be a negative power because we're dividing. And we're going back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 times. Okay, so these are numbers in standard form. And what we're going to do is we're going to write them as ordinary numbers. So we're going to take the numbers out of standard form and convert them back to ordinary numbers. So the first number we've got here is 5 times 10 to the power of 6. So it's 5 times 10, 6 times. So 5 times 10 once goes to 50. Twice, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 6.1 times 10, 8 times. So times 10 once goes to 61. And then I need 7 more times. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 3.71 times 10 once goes to 37.1, twice to 371, 3, 4, 5. 8 times 10 to the power of minus 7, a minus power means we're dividing by 10. So once goes to 0 0.8, twice to 0 0.08, so 5, 6, 7 zeros. six zeros and then the eight. So if we had eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So eight divided by ten, seven times, goes to eight times ten minus seven. Six point two times ten to the power of minus five. Gone six point two, one, two, three, four, five. And we can have five zeros and then five eight. Five point eight seven times ten to the power minus six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, see if you can have a try at these ones. So pause the video, give them a go, and then I'll go through the answers. Okay, so 4 times 10 to the power of 3 means 4 times 10 3 times. So 4 once, twice, 3 times. 8.91 times 10 to the power of 7. So times 10 once to get to 89.1, twice to get to 891. And we need 5 more times. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Times 8.2 once to get to 82. And then you need four more times. We divide in three by ten five times. So we're going to have four zeros. And then the three. One, two, three, four, five. Seven point five times ten to the minus four. So that's going to give us three zeros. And then the seven five. One, two, three, four. Nine point one six times ten to the power of minus eight. We're going to have seven zeros and then nine one six one two three four five six seven eight